First of all, I want to say how sorry I am. I'm trying to roll my windows up, y'all. Hold on. Uh, okay. Because I'm going to be losing light in a minute. And I've been gone all day. Now, listen, y'all. I want to say that I am really, really... Yeah, I know, y'all. Don't talk about me. I'm missing my earring. Don't trip. Anyway. Hey, guys. Hi, y'all. Hi, y'all. Y'all have not seen me in a couple of days. Y'all had to be home. I had to regroup. I had to put myself together. Okay. Um, also, y'all know my phone was tripping. My videos was cutting out. I really couldn't do no videos. And I told y'all when I got back here, I was going to fix all that shit. And I did, y'all. So, I went and got me another iPhone. Or whatever the case may be. Um, this is what I was doing uh, my, my videos on. And this one was acting like a punk-ass bitch or whatever. Okay. So... I was like, well, fuck this one. Let me go on and get another phone. So, that's what I did, guys. And so, now I'm able to do my videos comfortably. I don't have to worry about it cutting off on me or any of that. This should have a lot of storage on it. Because, A, I just bought it. And, B, this is just going to be my um, my um, YouTube uh, phone. So, I'm not taking pictures or anything on this phone right here. Okay? So, we should keep storage in this phone. Um, I want to say to all my subscribers, all my people who've been with me, all my 96, thank you guys, because I've been having technical difficulties, y'all. First is my house not keeping up the internet, so I can't send my video videos out to the next day. Then, But I always told you guys, when Satan knows that you're trying to do something, he's going to always try to, you know, get in the way. But we don't worry about Satan. Satan is beneath us and behind us. Bye-bye, Satan. You see that? Bye-bye, Satan. So we're not going to trip on him. We're not going to even give him no motherfucking play. Period. Okay? So, thank you guys for still being subscribed to me. Thank you guys for waiting on me. Thank you for the people that have been commenting on my videos. Um, just showing me love. Like, we here. Like, what's up? Like, where you at? You know what I'm saying? So, thank you guys for still interacting with me i really appreciate it guys i really do but i so thank you for subscribing and thank you for still being subscribed for anybody who's watching me today and you're new make sure you guys hit that button right there leave me some comments down below and share my video y'all so people can know about the motherfucking green green teams a uh, nation okay um as you guys already know i changed the name the name to green kitty cat and um i like it it fit me um i think i'm a fucking green kitty cat green is about the money okay the kitty cat because i'm a cute kitty cat purr. okay so i like that name it fit me y'all and that's the new channel name so we the green nation around this motherfucker okay we not doing no gangs we ain't no gang okay but we nations okay we a nation around this motherfucker okay so we got all that out the way also you can follow me on all my social medias um instagram snapchat twitter um green kitty cat capital g r e e n k i i t y k a t green kitty cat and then on my facebook montrace johnson m o n t r a c e j o h n s o n hold on y'all i know y'all like damn she always taping when she ordering food because y'all this is my only downtime i'm always so busy moving around that the only time i have time is when i'm eating now, the line kind of long a little bit. I'm ready. Can I get started, Peachy? Okay, can I have a number two? Number two, okay, for the drink? Um, a pink lemonade, extra ice, but I don't want no lettuce and no tomato on the number three. I want extra cheese on it, okay? No lettuce and no tomato? Uh-huh. And extra, okay. an extra cheese. And then give me an, a five-layer burrito. And then give me another five-layer burrito without the nacho sauce. The nacho cheese sauce. Okay. And that will be all. Any sauce? If you have ketchup and mild sauce, would be really great. I'm sorry? Ketchup and mild sauce. Oh, okay. Ketchup and mild sauce. Uh-huh. 14, 70, 87 at the window. Thank you. Okay, my bad. Sorry, y'all. I had to order my food. But it's a couple of people in front of us, so we should be good to be up to chit-chat, you know? I was going to do it when I parked and, and everything, but I seen that the daylight is going down. It is 6.04. So, I'm like, by the time I get to ordering my food and all that and park 
and maybe no daylight and i hate shooting videos for you guys and there's no day, day daylight especially y'all ain't seen me in a couple of days okay um so, oh, and so those are all my social medias you guys go check them out i'm just now starting my instagram and all of that so it's gonna take me time to build it but my facebook is it's you know you'll see everything back in the days me my children my husband um all of that that's if the nosy people the nosy people go to, go to my facebook okay um so y'all got that okay we got all that out the way so guys let me tell you guys you guys are gonna be so proud of me I told y'all I'm gonna make my channel first part priority. I told you guys that I just needed a minute. So now I have the minute. So I've been reaching out. I've been reaching out to a lot of people that I be I'm subscribed to. I, I've been reaching out to them, seeing if they'll help me, guide me. You feel me? So one person hit me back. She's a big YouTuber, um, really big. And I got contact with her and so I I've been paying so I paid her. So she's gonna be my mentor. She's been giving me so much game, guys. She's been giving me game on how to, you know, how to put my videos out, how to put tags on them, um, YouTube studios. She she just giving me uh, so much information, you know, how to edit my videos, just everything that I need to know, because I don't know, you know. So everything that I need to know to make my channel be great you know what i mean so she's been telling me a whole lot i've been writing it all down and she's going over it with me so that's kind of too wild I've kind of been off of here as well because i've just been kind of learning and getting game you know um hold on y'all um so i've been learning getting game i'm almost uh, okay hold on hold on y'all hold on hello Hi, how are you? well in yourself Okay, fourteen eighty seven. All right, all right, all right. Mm hmm So, um, she been giving me game or whatever the case may be. Also, I got in contact with a girl who's gonna do my intro and my outro, but she need me to send her some things. Like she need me to send some videos of me. I had to get my channel name and then I also had to get some Instagrams and all the, you know, my social media together. It was no need for her to do my intro, outro if I didn't have no social media. So that's what um I've been doing, y'all. Okay, keep that change. I can't grab that. Would you like to No. Can I have an extra bag? Extra bag? Uh-huh. And napkins. A lot of napkins. Oh, shit. I just heard my nail, y'all. So, anyway. Um. Mm. Okay. So... Thank you. And extra napkins. Yeah, no okay. Thank you. Have a blessed one. So, so um, sorry you guys. I had to get my food. And they they quick. They quick with it. But I'm gonna put it right here in park and eat and talk and all that good shit. Okay, hold on, y'all. I'm gonna pull in. I'm all fucked up right now. Okay. Anywho, so that's kind of what I've been doing since I haven't been on here in a day or a day. I've been kind of, kind of getting my shit together. You know what I'm saying? Getting my little shit together, y'all. All right, I'm gonna close this, close this on up. All right. Anyway, so I'm just been getting my shit together. So I got the girls gonna do my intro, outro. She just need me. She just need me to send, you know, her the things that she needs to make it pop. And I gotta find the music I want. You know, this, that, and the third. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna be doing that. Then I had to get my. Um, my social media is together. I got that. So I'm. I, so this channel is gonna go up, you guys. I got me. A, I went on Amazon. I got me a bomb ass backdrop, y'all. Cause I. I think I'm gonna start doing it where with a backdrop. Y'all know how I just been doing it any type of way. No, I'm gonna start doing it where I have my backdrop. And the backdrop, y'all, is fucking amazing. Sorry, y'all. My seatbelt is going off, and I don't feel like turning my car off and doing all that. So just bear with me, y'all. This is a quick video. This ain't. This is a real video, but ain't a real video. Feel me? Anyway, um. I got a bomb ass backdrop that you ain't seen nobody with, y'all. I got like little things that's gonna set it up and be really, really pretty. Um, so I can't wait to Amazon set me up. And I was asking my mentor, like, do you think I should get a camera? Do you think I should get a laptop and all that? And she was like, No, it's just easier to do it off your phone. It's just so much easier to do it off your phone. So that's why I ended up buying a whole new phone or whatever. So I just bought another eleven. 
and I really wasn't trying to buy another phone because the new iPhones were going to come out. And I wanted to get a new iPhone. But for certain, I'm not buying another iPhone. That's it. I got two iPhones. That's enough. And I got a regular motherfucking Android. Okay? I ain't buying. Fuck that. I ain't giving my iPhone all that money. This fucking um, 11 was um, $900 and some change. Okay? I was like, for a phone? Anyway. So, um... Yeah, guys, so I'm really happy my channel is going to get so much better, you guys, because I'm investing. I'm putting money in my channel. I'm putting money in, 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 and I'm learning and I'm, you know, getting better, you know, and all of that and all of this. So just give me time. I want to say by the end of this month, for sure, that my channel will be a real channel. It's going to be up and popping and all of that shit. So just give me a minute. I'm going to be doing mukbangs. I'm going to be doing makeup hair. I'm going to be doing all type of shit, y'all. It won't just be me talking. It'll be more more shit um so that's that what else um i've been good you know i'm still having a little problem with my little nanny i got going on y'all whoo i mean she is a horrible nanny y'all she is fucking horrible y'all she is so bad like my my seven-year-old son no fuck my son because he no my daughter my six-year-old daughter can babysit her brothers better than this lady can now i got y'all know i had three nannies now i only got two nannies okay i got uh money and Nas. Nas is my college girl that's the one who i told y'all was kind of weird a little bit i'm sorry y'all about that beeping i really really am but anyway Nas is a 21 year old who goes to howard but because howard is down she got to do it in, on her computer out here in las vegas or whatever the case may be so i've been hiring her and her problem like i, I wrote a schedule out for her like okay nine o'clock in the morning this is what you do this and that and the third she ain't getting that together so then i'm like okay so then she fed my kids peanut butter and jelly sandwich at night for dinner i have no problem at lunchtime or even a snack them having that but for me for dinner they need a meal you get what i'm saying so kids can go to sleep you bathe you get a meal and you go to fucking bed watch the tv and you go to bed but if you play with them at night then they're gonna be hungry like you give me so okay fine she's young and i understand that but now money is younger than her money's 17 and money got this shit going money got this shit going so i don't know if it's different lifestyles i don't fucking know she does not want to whip the kids or yell at them or anything and my kids are like this they're good kids but my kids because i give them so much voice as you've noticed if y'all seen them where you, you just got to show them who you are one time and you ain't got to do it no more whatever that show may be whether you take shit from them and they hate that because them they're me and their daddy is buying them shit every day damn near in their rooms they got everything they want so it's easy to discipline my kids it's so easy to make them be on some act right shit so um so that was going on that was going on so i'm like she got the kids running around the whole house running around the whole house me and my husband end up you know intervening or whatever okay cool so i said you know what i gotta talk to her before i just fire her because she's so sweet i said before i just fire her let me talk to her so i go in the media room we have a conversation i'm like hey nazi i was like i know you're a good babysitter i said but you you're not showing good you know what is the problem she's like well i'm trying to get them to listen to me they're not listening this and that they're in the third um blase blase I said, okay, kids. So I wanted the kids to know that I'm backing her. Normally, I don't do that with the new nannies because I want to make sure that my kids, if, they, if the nannies do something wrong, my kids are able to tell me. But I don't see her doing anything motherfucking wrong. So, and, and they were doing shit so bad, I had to let them know I got her back. You feel me? So I put my little funk on it. Like, y'all fuck up, y'all not listening, this and that. It's going to be a problem with me. Nazi, you come and tell me. All right? Okay. We got that together. I asked my kids, is anything better that Nazi can do? One of them said this stupid shit. Um, I want Nazi to let me uh, make my own cereal. The other one said, I want to sleep later. I mean, crazy shit they're talking about, right? Also, I was having a problem with Nazi because Nazi, I pay from 9 to 6.30. 9 a.m. to 6.30 p.m., okay? And I pay $650 every Friday. So today, she's supposed to get paid every Friday, okay? But she don't start really, she get there at 9, but she's downstairs doing her homework or schoolwork or in school or whatever the fuck she's doing until 11 o'clock. So she don't really start working until goddamn 12 o'clock. You got, and, and, and in the beginning, I wasn't having a problem with that as long as, as long as my kids is okay and everything is done. But it's not. So, to, so, so that was two days ago we had a talk. Yesterday, 
rent, the kids ran the house. I'm like, okay, she's still not getting it. So today when her ass got here, I said, okay, y'all finna go to Kangamoo. Girl, they at the Kangamoo. I have Ubered they ass. Well, they home now. They I Ubered her to Kangamoo. Like when you, cause what she wants to do is sit in my media room and do motherfucking nothing. I've already asked you to watch the kids. I've already asked you to put them on a program and or follow the program I have. And you still won't do it. So let me put you in a place where you have no fucking choice but to be a nanny. Because at my house, maybe you think, I don't know, because you see me and my husband here. I don't know what the fuck you're thinking. So let me take you out of the environment. Like, you're not the nanny that can stay home and kick it. You know what I'm saying? I really don't try to put too much on my girls. You know, I got a maid. You're not cooking and cleaning. You're not doing any of that. My kids are old enough. Mind you, my kids are six, seven, and eight. They're old enough for you to tell them what to do. The job is not that hard, y'all. And I make it so sweet, okay? I really, really do. Y'all know me a little bit. Y'all know I make it so sweet. You know what I'm saying? You don't got to wash clothes. You ain't got to cook. You ain't got to do nothing but just make sure the kids don't kill their fucking self. You feel me? Do some schoolwork with them. Get them dressed. And you know, she let them wear pajamas all day. We don't do that. No, I want them to wake up and know when they wake up, clean up their room, take their vitamins, brush their teeth, get dressed. That's what the fuck you do. You don't sit home and lounge all day. Now, we may lounge on a Sunday or something like that. But no, you get up and you prepare for life. You feel me? So she can't get it together so now i'm like okay i got you girl she was so mad she came in work she thought she was gonna sit down and do some homework i don't give a fuck about all that i don't i don't give a fuck about all that okay because whatever you're doing don't pay you until you finish what i'm doing you pay you in in every friday bitch so i'm really not giving a fuck about none of that now i, I was giving a fuck about you going to school because i am about education but when your education is fucking up with with, 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 with your job i got a problem with that you know um, so when she got here and I, and, and, and I didn't say nothing right away. And so I heard the kids just running around the motherfucking house. I said, oh, okay, number one, my kids want to play. I'm going to take y'all ass where y'all can run in somebody else's shit, which is Kangamoo, Chuck E. Cheese and all them other people. Y'all go run there. Y'all, it was about 11 o'clock. I sent they ass there. She, she was like, well, I haven't fed them breakfast. I said, they can eat there. They serve pizza and shit. It's almost lunchtime. They can eat it there. Then she was like, well, she that bitch was lost, honey. She thought she was going to come in this motherfucker and sit down in my theater room, put her feet up, do her schoolwork, talk to her nigga, and do all of that while my kids... No, we're not doing that. Every time you step through my fucking door, I'm sending you the fuck out with my kids. That's how I got to do you. Ain't no relaxation. Ain't no you can kick it in the house. Can't be none of that because you done fucked it all up for everybody. So, I said, everybody get their mask, get dressed, and get the fuck out of my house. Girl, she was lost like, well, well girl, I don't give a fuck. Girl, that's how we doing it now, girl. Either I'm going to have to do that or fire you. Like, either way. And I, when I talked to her a couple of days ago, like, do you like this job? Do you want to work? Do you want to make it work? She was like, I, I do, I do. Okay, well, bitch, this is how we going to make this work then. Since you don't know how to gather my kids together, bitch, since you don't know how to gather them, bitch, let me show you how, how we going to do this. I'm going to send your ass away with them where they can gather where you can, they can gather in a play place and you ain't got to gather them. They can just be wild because they're at a place where they can be wild. You feel me? So, girl, she did this with that. So, I had called them to make sure they was open. Also, they do birthday parties. So, and when they do birthday parties, they shut it down kind of early. Girl, I called. I said, y'all open? They said, yeah. I said, y'all got any birthday parties? They said, yeah, but not until 5. I said, oh, okay. Because usually they close at like 7. Y'all, I Ubered they at. She's like, well, you want me to drive? Girl, no. Girl, no. You seem real simple, bitch. You can't drive my kids. So, Uber they ass there. This she called about three o'clock. Now mind you, they had been there from about twelve. Now it's about three o'clock. Um, they ready? I said no, no, no. I said no. They'll be. I said I'll, um, Uber y'all home about four thirty. I said about because they close at five. I said at four thirty. Um, she's like, well, they have this, this. They're hungry. and There's nothing really eat here. I said some candy. Kids love candy. I said get some fruit snacks up in there. Get some apple juice. Whatever fuck you can find up in that place, and go on and feed the kids that until uh I Uber y'all back at five o'clock and you can feed them dinner. That's how we gonna do that. Well, okay. Uh huh, bitch. Yeah, you're gonna be there all day, bitch all day but you don't know how to be in my house and relax you don't know how to do your work and relax so you got to do that girl so she, i opened her ass about five o'clock girl right when that motherfucker was about to close cousins five o'clock over her ass there i was like okay you, you in the house call me when you in the house she said she was in the house i'm like all right cool uh fix their dinner bathe them and then you know you'll be off in a little bit so now it's 6 20 I'm on this side because y'all just went and got my hair done, y'all. I got like little finger waves or whatever the case may be because I, I I didn't feel like her. I didn't want to stay in a beauty, beauty shop that long. I didn't feel like it today, but my hair was looking real fucking crazy. So I wanted and I needed to get washed because it was itching. So I went on and let her do this for me. And then next Thursday, I'll switch it. And then I went and got my nails done, y'all, because my nails was looking horrible. Y'all see, it got, it's, on, it's apples and watermelon, y'all, with the ombre. I went and got my nails done and my eyebrows. All right, y'all, I got to go. Bye-bye. Comment and uh, leave some shit down below. Bye, y'all.